So like the rest of the UK, you've probably been watching season three of Clarkson's Farm. So in one of the episodes, Jeremy comes up with the idea to make stinging nettle soup. And apparently it just tastes like stinging nettles. What does a stinging nettle taste like? And so today I'm gonna go forage in the woods, go find some stinging nettles and make soup out of it. I forgot to unlock the door. Let's get the show on the road. So we're at the woods. I've just packed up my car. I'm gonna show you guys what I'm gonna bring. My skiing gloves. I don't wanna sting my hands because I'm quite terrified of that. Will I probably get stung today? Yes. Next thing I got are these cutter things, but I don't know how to open them. They've got like this weird like twisty thing here that's stopping them from opening. And I don't know how to take that off. So I'm probably literally just gonna have to use my hands to get rid of the sting nettles, but it's the thought that counts. And I'm also bringing a Tesco bag to put uh, said stinging nettles in. I am now in the woods on the hunt for stinging nettles. Oh my God, finally, okay. I found some, I found some stinging nettles. So I'm gonna get these really quickly and then I'm gonna get out of here because I'm afraid. Oh, oh Jesus, the time has come to see if these actually work against stinging nettles. Yes, they do. Okay, okay, I'm fine, I'm so fine. Right, I don't know how to go about doing this. I've been told to get it from like the bottom. Oh God, this feels so wrong. This bag is literally full of stinging nettles and I'm going to be eating them. <sighs> What's my life come to? Oh my God, I am sweating. Christ. I was wearing a jumper because I was like, oh, so I won't sting my arms. And instead I've nearly had bloody heat stroke. Right, so I'm home. A bag full of stinging nettles. First step is I apparently need to put them in uh, cold water to clean them. And that also apparently gets rid of most of the sting. Right, as that fills up, I'm putting my gloves back on. The sink is full of water. I'll show you in a second because I've got my gloves on. However, I am now going to put in a bunch of stinging nettles in the sink. This is the weirdest thing I think I've possibly ever done. <gasps> oh my god! There's a spider in the bag! Oh god, what do I do? You don't understand. I don't like I don't like I do not like spiders. Sorry, my dog's just running because he's like, are you okay girl? Oh my god, where's it gone? Okay, so this is as far as I've gotten. This is my dog, by the way. His name's Archie. Isn't he such a cool guy? It's in here somewhere. <gasps> oh my God, I've just seen it move. I'm not even joking. I actually might get rid of those nails and just deal with the ones I've got because I cannot put my hand in there. Oh, oh I don't know where it is. Oh, Lord. How did that sting me for the gloves? Oh, oh God. Ow. I might get rid of these nettles and just use the ones I've already got because I've got quite a bit and um, I don't want to, I don't want to deal with this. Right, okay, this is the current situation. I sort of just need to get them all sort of under the water and I do need to pick like these like stems off them. So after a near mental breakdown, I've sorted out the uh, stinging nettles. I've gotten rid of like most of all the big stems and they are just in like cold water. There is still some in there, but I'm too afraid of the spider. So the next thing that I apparently need to do is cut up my potatoes, my onion, my garlic. Let's do that. I've got my potatoes and uh, I need to take the skin off. And I don't know how many to, how many I should cut. Maybe, maybe like three. I don't know. Either way, I bought a big bag of potatoes. So I think I've got enough. I've suddenly just remembered why I always let my boyfriend do this because I'm not having a good time. This is by no means a cooking channel, by the way. Uh, clearly, if you couldn't tell, I don't know how to cook, but here we are. Cutting my potatoes. I've cut my potatoes. Uh, now I'm gonna do the same with uh, the garlic and also the onion. Right, I've got my onion and my eyes are literally already starting to water. So not ideal. Oh my God. I am very quickly remembering why I don't cook. Ah, this is not okay. My eyes. I'm sorry, yeah, but how did we ever find out that it was okay to eat onions? Cause like, if I was like a chef back in the day, yeah, trying to figure out what was good to eat and what wasn't, I would not have said onions. You should not be in pain whilst cutting, whilst eating something that's edible. But then again, I am eating stinging nettles, so who am I really to judge? You know what is acceptable to eat though? Garlic. I love garlic, yeah? I could live off of garlic. It is actually unreal. Right, so sorry, my kettle is boiling, but I've got a pan here, and I'm gonna put, if I can open it, a little bit of uh, oil in. Ew, oh God. Oh, I can't open it. Oh, okay, there we go. Oh, 
we've got the ovens on. I nearly just put my hand on the stove. That is why I do not cook. Oil in there. And now I'm gonna put my garlic and my onions in there. Uh, bearing in mind, I am possibly the worst chef in the world. There was this one time I made carbonara on a, a live stream and I didn't even know what medium heat was on the oven. Do you know what I mean? Like, I ain't no Gordon Ramsay. Oh, okay. It's going everywhere. Lovely. I'm gonna be so honest with you. I don't know what that's doing. Uh, honest to God, I, I don't know what the point of this is. I don't know what's going on. Either way, makes me feel like a bit of a chef. Let's go, let's go with five. Boil in hot water in here. There we go. You do your thing, potatoes. Are you like, cause I'm actually chefing, yeah? Like, this smells nice. You hear the sizzles? I know anybody that's like cooking or like knows how to cook is cringing at this video. I just wanted to eat nettles. Potatoes are starting to boil. Guys, we've had a bit of an emergency. I forgot to add the bloody vegetable stock. I need to put this in with my potatoes. I forgot and it's already starting to boil. Oh my God, everything's going wrong. <laughs> Right, so it comes in this little cube thing. Do I know what to do with this? Absolutely not. Oh God, I'm really not a chef. I need my mum to help me because <laughs> this is not going well. Do I crush it? Oh, <laughs> that looks extremely suspicious. Oh God, I was supposed to have done this so very long ago. Oh God, I need to turn this around as well. Oh Jesus Christ. I don't like this. Oh my god, I spilled water everywhere. Everything is going wrong. I am not doing well. Please get me a therapist. Oh Jesus Christ. This right now should not be happening. I should, there shouldn't be stinging nettles in my sink and I shouldn't, that shouldn't look like that. Okay, somebody told me to put a pan over it. I don't know why. Either way, I'm gonna take this off now. Ow, 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 ow. I don't, what do I do with this? Oh god, I really did not think that through. I forgot it'd be like wet from condensation, do you know what I mean? I've actually changed my mind. I don't want my mum to come home. I don't want her to see this. Garlic and onions now in with the potatoes. What's that guy called? You know, you know the guy who does the salt thing? That's what I'm trying to like replicate. <laughs> I've definitely put too much in, I'll just come up. I'm also gonna put a little bit of garlic uh, pepper in. This is what it's looking like at the moment. You can barely even see it. I'm gonna wait for the uh, potatoes to get all soft. And then it's time for the main attraction. I am terrified of that. I mean, just look at them. That should not be consumed. But the things I do for YouTube, eh? Okay, guys, it's now, it's time. The moment has begun. There, going in there. And then that is gonna go in my belly and I'm really scared. Okay, so really quickly, I'm gonna put my gloves on. I don't think there is actually any more stings left on the nettles, but I'm gonna put them on just to be just in case, because I am gonna be holding a pan full of boiling hot water, and if I sting, I might reflex and drop everything everywhere, and then I could die a very painful death. Anyways, I'm gonna put nettles in there now. Okay, this is heavy. Nettles, bam. Oh my God. Literally, everything we've made is now covered in nettles. By the way, I have no idea how much I'm supposed to be putting in here. I'd say this looks sufficient. I mean, this is basically all of the nettles anyway. So this is what it looks like. Do this for a, for a while. This has genuinely got to be up there with one of the weirdest things I've ever done. I found the big stem. I'm trying to cut it away with the spoon. Okay, so this is what it's looking like at the moment. And, ah! and apparently it needs to be like that now for about five minutes-ish. Okay, so the timer is now going off. The dog is barking. Even he can't believe what's about to happen. Right, it is now time to put the soup in the blender to blend up the uh, nettles, which apparently you don't actually have to do, but I think I'd be a little bit more comfortable eating it if I can't tell it's nettles. It is now time to take a look at what this looks like. Ah! I really should have like a proper lid for this. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, it's, um, it's interesting looking. Right, so I've got my trusty, trusty blender. If I know how to pull that part. I have a feeling this is gonna go really wrong. I'm actually gonna do this over the sink. Ah, that's so heavy and also really hot. Ew, there's the last bits here, which I'm just gonna put into the blender. That is now the blender. That is what it looks like. Absolutely disgusting, I can't lie. I'm really dreading trying this, but oh my goodness, that is so heavy. It's a blend. All right. I'm gonna turn it on. There is a soup section, but I think I'm just gonna blend it, to be honest. I don't know, low. 
my god. That looks disgusting. Ew! I don't want to eat that. They said it was nice on Clarkson's farm, but that does not look nice. Oh my god, actually look at that. That is so disgusting. And now it's unfortunately time to try it. Also, my mum's just got home, so I'm going to make her try it as well. And she's going to be like, what? And honestly, I don't really blame her. Nicola Brett is now behind the camera, so hello. Hello. <laughs> Oh god, well it's hot, so there's that. Well you don't want cold soup, do you? That looks so grim! I've just come home from work to this, by the way. But it tastes lovely, smells nice. I mean, look at it. This is the first soup I've ever made in my life, by the way. And it's stinging nettles. Bon appetit! This is salt and pepper. pepper. Oh yeah, do you want salt and pepper in it? No, I put, nice. Well, I put a bit of salt and pepper in it when I cooked it already. Right, you ready? I've got a big spot. Cheers! Cheers. Hmm. Actually quite nice. nice, quite impressive for a soup. It's alright, I'm gonna add salt to it. Need more garlic. Yeah, well I put three cloves of garlic in it. Maybe another three. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> it's a bit bland. Okay, I've added salt to it. It's, it's not that bad. This is really weird, we're eating stinging nettles. Again, I guess. It's actually quite, not that bad. Quite impressed. It's nice. I did a thing! I would eat this. I am eating it. Look at her go. She's eating a creation I made. More cooking, please, so I don't have to cook when I come home. That would be fantastic. I mean, I think if you saw the cooking process, you would disagree because I was very stressed out. It's actually weirdly all right. But I think more more garlic. Mm. And uh, a bit more thickness to it as well. Yeah, well, I didn't add enough potatoes to it. I noticed that as I was in the look. Well, you can thicken it with corn flour as well if needed. Oh, I was supposed to add flour. <laughs> It's not watery though, it's quite thick, but it would be nice if it was thicker. That's the and consistency of it. Garlic. Yeah, it's not too bad. No. In fact, I want to eat it, but I don't because we're having big tea. Oh! Look at me go! Bloody cheers. Okay, so that is the end of the video. It's so weird that you can actually eat stinging nettles. I think I did actually a decent job. I mean, I know it was a bit messy and I didn't really know what I was doing, but... I think I did a decent job and like it actually tasted surprisingly nice, which I couldn't imagine. Anyways, thank you guys so, so much for watching today's video. If you guys wanted like a similar sort of video like this or if you guys have any other video suggestions, just comment them down below. Make sure to give this video a massive thumbs up and also subscribe and turn on my post notifications and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.